Hello everyone, we're back. Welcome to another edition of Magic Gathering Online, presented by Kentucky Eclipse Gaming. And I'm your player for tonight, Chappelle. And let me ask you all this question. Have you ever, ever wanted to be completely degenerate and just take infinite turns all over the time with having Planeswalkers on the board? Well, that's what we're going to do tonight. We're going to attempt to play Planeswalker Control with extra turns. The goal is very simple with this deck. One, have lots of planes blockers out. Two, find our extra turn card, cast them, and take infinite turns, and hopefully get our opponents to scoop. How are we doing that? Well, it's, it's quite simple. I'll show you what we're playing with tonight. Oh, shoot. Yeah. Oh. I always forget. Yeah. There we go. Okay, so what are we playing with tonight? Well, as you can see here, this is what we got with tonight so far. <clears throat> so, what extra turn cards are we running? Well, we've got our famous Time Warp. Five mana, three blue blue to take a target player to actually take an extra turn after this one. Real simple. We also got our, uh, we also found another one called Savor the Moment. This is a three mana spell. One blue blue. Take an extra turn of this one, skip the untapped up, skip the untapped up of that turn. So you're going to tap with it, and then, so you cast it, and then you'll be able to untap it on the next extra turn. But uh, what else uh, What else are we uh, going to be running as well? Well, we also have, we have Nexus of Fate here, which I should probably just do this, because it's not showing up, is it? It is not. Let's do card view. Yeah, a little bit. Hang on a second, let me get these things here turned off. There we go. And then let's just go and enlarge this shit. All right, yeah. So let's see, I was showing you Time Warp, uh, right here, Time Warp, Savor the Moment. And then of course we have the most degenerative one they've ever printed, it's Nexus of Fate, which is seven mana, five blue blue. Take an extra turn of this one. The difference is, <laughs> this is an instant. And the next fate we put in a grave for anywhere you reveal it and show it in your daughter's library. So you can take infinite turns with this card. How, how are we doing that? Well, we got a little bit of a, of a bank control deck here. Um, we'll go over the land base here in just a second. We're going to start off our deck with uh, two preordains, uh, some growth spirals, uh, guineas of the trial, uh, narset, uh, uh, teferi, three mana. And of course we're running uh, three of the blue-white Narset. This lets us... Yes, we have internet currently. <laughs> Came and gone about an hour ago. We have uh, the blue-white Narset. This lets us look at the top, top card of our library. If it's a non-creation on land, like a time extra turn spell, we can reveal it from our hand. But the negative two is when you cast an instant sorcery spell from your hand this turn, you gain his rebound. So hopefully we find our extra turn, cast it. We negative two Narset, cast the extra turn. And we get an extra turn after that. So it's two turns on top of that. Uh, we are controls. We are got two uh, Supreme Verdicts in our deck for this. Uh, we also are trying out an Urza Assembles the Titans. It's a five mana enchantment saga for a three white white. Chapter one is Scry four. Then you reveal the top card of your library. If it's a Planeswalker card, reveal this way, put it in your hand. So we're looking for our Planeswalkers. Uh, chapter 2, you may put a Planeswalker card with mana value 6 or less from your grave on the battlefield. So you get a free Planeswalker for, for, for on Chapter 2. And then Chapter 3, <coughs> you can activate uh, the loyalty abilities of Planeswalker Control twice this turn rather than only once. And it kind of works with like Oath of the Fairy. Oath of the Fairy is a 3 blue-white legendary enchantment. It says, enters the battlefield, exile on another target permanent you control, which is going to be a Planeswalker. Return it to the battlefield, under zone control, begin the next end step. You can activate abilities of points walker twice this turn. So we want to get to our points walkers. Ultimate is very powerful uh, in the deck. In our points walkers, like I said, we have four getting in the trial. This is going to be our win conditions. Also, is a emblem that we keep the getting on the field. We can't lose the game. Uh, two narsets, uh, three fairies, uh, three blue white uh, uh, narsets. We also got a hero dominaria, and also some champion. So those are our Planeswalkers in the main board. And also to go along with it, we have uh, Wilderness Reclamation. Beginning of your intercept, step, untap all lands you feel. This is the card that goes with Nexus of Fate because with Nexus of Fate on the, uh, you cast Nexus of Fate. Intercept, this is a trigger. Untap your lands, cast Nexus of Fate, float mana, all that stuff. 
So we have played against this degenerative uh, combo in the past on here on the channel, and we're going to play it tonight as part of the being degenerate as well. So we also got three ley line bindings and three two prismatic endings because our land base is pretty much bant. We've got a one besiege you, a Ganjo, an Ottawara. We've got actually I might do this just because of Blood Moon. Uh, we've got uh, one forest, one plains, and two island and, and two islands. Um, actually, we might be able to go. Let's see. No, I think that's fine. We can go this. Yeah, Blood Moon can be a thing. So we're gonna we cut a misty out of the plains. We got two. We got two islands, two plains, and a forest. We've got flooded strands, hollow fountains, interplanar beacon. Whenever we cast planes, we regain life. <coughs> and for one <coughs> tap, <coughs> we can have two mana different colors. So we can cast our, our Narf set, we can cast our Teferis, and all that stuff like that. And of course we got a Sparse headquarters because it's a Forest Plain Islands. And simply we got a Zatorius Proving Ground. This gets us our Mountain Swamp to make our way on bindings cost one. Other than that, we got your basic Shocks and Fetches for Bant decks. So that's that's the main board. And the sideboard, it's kind of a basic sideboard you got here. We got two Surgical Extractions. Actually, we might take those out for... Uh, uh, we got two rest in pieces. Uh, actually, let's do this. Yeah, I like that. So, we're going to go three rest in pieces that covers the graveyard hate, four Dovin's Fields that covers control. Make sure our stuff gets, uh, make sure we can counter our, uh, make sure we can protect our stuff. Actually, I'm going to do this. Should have pack negation. Yeah, there we go. Alright. So now I've added one pack of negation and three Dovin's Vetoes. Three rest in pieces. Four lay on safety because Thought Seas and Scam decks could ruin this deck immensely. Three Chalice of the Voids and Emrakul. So basically, we're not trying to go for like everything. We're just trying to like seriously stop. Um, like, I, we don't care. Tr we don't care about Tron that much because we're in Dovin's Veto. Other stuff. We're going to care about. We just make sure that our stuff gets um, so. With the pack negation, if we take an extra turn, we can essentially pay the mana, take an extra turn. It's not going to affect us the paint spell. So let's get into the practice lobby to see how this deck does. We're going to play five games tonight. And we're going to see how we do. So let's get to it. Oh. I'll turn the record on. La 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 la. Alright, here we go. It would have been live last night, but we had no internet last night. We didn't have internet till 3 o'clock in the morning this morning, and then it went off. It's been off during the day. Yeah, so it's just been really, really bad. Alright, let's get to it. Let's get into the games. And we already got a matchup. Coco Nash? Really? Oh. Let's see what we got. How are we starting this off? Misty? Yeah, I guess I'll keep this. We got, we got removal, verdict, and three lands. So. Let's see how we do. We're going to play five games tonight. See how the deck does. We're going to see if this is actually league playable. Island. Right off the bat. Ooh. Merktide Control or Morfolk. Could be. Who the fuck knows? What missing pass? Alright, 
chat. What deck do you think they're playing? They start off with an I with oh, they go Island and Lauren revealed. So and they reveal a catch a triumph. So what are they playing? Play a little game. What are they playing with that? Why the hell? There we go. Thank you. And they play the catch a triumph. Step, we're gonna sack. We're gonna go get our. We're gonna go get our. Spars headquarters. Faster. He says they're playing. We got a vote for rhinos. Ooh. I like that. Play uh, we'll play the wind swept teeth and fast turn. So your vote is for rhinos. Okay. So this verdict's gonna be real good. Like real good. And there it is, crashing footballs. In the turn we're gonna sack and we're gonna go get the proving grounds. A narrowly line binding so now cost one. Alright, so let's so crashing footfalls. They so got five cards in hand. Uh Getting resolved. So you got a force negation or spell pierce. We throw out the Gideon for. He force negation. Where did he pitch? He pitched the force. So he got rid of two force negations. There you go. All right. That. May have just been. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about. It. I don't. I don't know how he. That's a good idea. State Farm people. Well, the standard deck doesn't play um, force or spell pierce, but anybody. This this is the free room. This could be any kind of brew. They could have a spell pierce in there somewhere. Who knows. Right, we need it. We need the fairy. That's what we need. Is he freezing on our upkeep? No, he's not. So we're gonna play this pretty cool. No, we don't need to save her right now. Yeah, I agree. I I agree, but. Like you said, like you said, there could be people running the uh, the um, what is it the uh, living 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 in living the living in uh, Rhino's deck. So and it's got what two counters left? Okay. He's taking a lot of turn, a lot of time to keep. Wilderness Reclamation. Does this get forced? He's already he's already spent two. It's good. Nice. Very nice. Trigger. I have nothing to play, so I'm not gonna float the green. Alright. <clears throat> okay. Cool. Yeah, what, one more turn on that? One more turn. <coughs> He's drawing three stuff with no, with no lands. All right. Oof, Adawara. I think... Play Urza, Symbol of the Titans. Let's see if he's got the uh, other Force Negation. He pitched... Wow. Wow. So now he's he's paid the fuck Christ. God. He's wasted three of them. And I still get I still get a lane trigger. So So 
So there comes that. He's going to cast Rhinos. <coughs> yeah. Now he plays a land. He's got one more Force Negation. He's going to Cascade. That's fine. But now this Supreme Bird is going to be really good. So he's going to Cascade into another Crashing Footfalls. Cool. Right. Right. Nice. Let's see what we draw. We draw Gideon. Uh... Verdict. Okay. We'll play the auto war. Go ahead. He's gone through two, uh, two footfalls. He's gone through... Three force negations. Was he even violent outburst or something? And what else? He, what else we got? We got a Narset. Uh, yeah, I'll play a Narset. Really? Violent outburst? Okay. He's going to hit another crashing footfalls. Cool. Boy. Okay. Narset's good. Let's go on negative two with Narset. And what do we get? What do we find? They play Mark Ties as well. Jesus Christ. Alright, so we've gone through three footfalls, a violent outburst, and three force negations. They should be running out of ammo here real fucking soon. <coughs> you know what really good with this deck? Uh, four mana mono blue to fairy. With the ability to flash it in on the instep and be able to just Use the ability. Well, do you think you can kill the Narset? Do you, do you really think that I'm worried about that? Let's see where he attacks with. Are they playing Murktide in this deck? Jesus Christ, man. That's nuts. So he's going at the Narset. That's fine. We'll flash in on Bunny. Take the Rhino. Okay. <clears throat> nice. Oh. Let's night two Narset because we just got a three fairy. Uh, let's take the pre name. He should have <laughs> negation this. Wow. Let's balance the Leyline Binding. Let's play a Preordain. Uh, 
Uh, bottom, top? Yeah, trigger on the stack. Oh, tap. So, so now he can't cascade. He's blown his force negations. Way to go, buddy. You did a great job. I think I think the the fairies need to go to four. Well, will take the fairy. Uh, I'm not worried about. I need lands. I need to get the seven lands. All right, there's our seventh land. I'm gonna go play this Narset. He can't really do anything about it. I'm gonna uptick. What do we got? What does she reveal? Nope, it's always a fucking land for me. <sighs> yeah, you know what? Cool. Trigger. Yeah. Nice. Mm -hmm. Play the island. Uptick. I don't know. I reveal Supreme Verdict. Well, the deck's working. Play this Gideon. Now, because we have a Gideon in hand, we're going to go ahead and zero. Go and get the emblem. Yeah. Now that we uptake the fairy. We can now verdict got in a flash. So, whoops, wrong zero. Was that the was that the bottom zero? Yep. Oops. Oh well. He just came in. <coughs> cool. You can go ahead, sir. Wilderness Reclamation is really, really good. It's also really, really stupid. I don't know what this guy's not doing. Because we, if we get the Narset emblem, he can't play anything. <coughs> I got the seven lands. What a reveal. Yeah, reveal a lot of money. Well, let's, uh, let's get that emblem going. Mm -hmm. Okay, he's still not... Pass turn. This should be game winning here real quick. Yep. Brandon, I think your deck needs Bullens Reclamation in it. Plays a land. And he plays what? Questing Beast. Sure. Questing Beast away. And who is he attacking? Let's find who's attacking first. <clears throat> he should attack the Teferi. He's attacking that Gideon. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll let it go. I, I got this other Gideon here. And now that's game. Get Narset's emblem. Lock the game out. 
balance of the questing beast. <coughs> Get that. Play another Gideon. Uh, uptick. Target the Triome. Play Misty. Crack. Let's get a Hollow Fountain. Yeah, I'll get a Hollow Fountain. And Step Trigger. Next is the fate. Cool. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. <coughs> Play your questing beast. Let's see who you're attacking. Who are you attacking? Attacking me. Well, can't have that. Cannot have that, sorry. Scoop it up, Ben. You're locked out. You are locked out of the game. Oh, let's see. Uptick Narset. God, it's always a fucking land, I swear to God. Oh. Plus one Gideon. Go to combat. Oof. Swing. Did you just really make me play this out all 25 minutes for God's sakes? Jesus Christ. Well, you can't play a Valent Outburst. And you can play Charlotte's Agent, but you can't cast your Crashing Footfalls. So, I don't know what you're going to do, buddy. Play another quest. Plays a Murktide! Cool. I'm trying to get this guy to quit. Well, 
Laylon bonding. Target the Murktide. Give it up. God damn it. Jesus Christ. I swear to God, it's always a land. Sure. Draw an Elspeth. Alright, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to negative three to fairy to draw a card. I'm going to bounce the Leylon Bonding with Murktide. Okay, we draw an island. I'm going to then play another to fairy. Okay. I'm going to uh, bounce. No, I can't. Oh, shit. Hang on. I need to find car. I need to find the time warps. That's what I need to find. So if I bounce. Okay, let's just do that. Let's just bounce this ley line. Okay. Draw hard. There's a time warp. Okay. Uh, I did not. Okay, we're still we're still fine. We're still fine. <clears throat> Next turn we'll do we'll do the infinite loop. Okay, well, uh, we don't need this island. He's not playing Blood Moon. So we're going to lay line behind the Murktide. Even if he kills, the, if he takes Narset the damage, like, I don't care. He's swinging at me. Like, I don't care about this. Yeah, I'll take three from the Murktide. Yeah, that's I'll take three from the Murktide, it's fine. I don't care. Boy, right, hold on. He didn't do any damage to me. So how the fuck did I take seven? Oh, really? Oh. Yeah, that's fine. He gets rid of the fairy. That's fine. He doesn't know what's about to happen. Really? Oh. Okay. Cool. <laughs> nice. Neato. Come on, dude. Go to game. Let's just go to game two. Like, I'm not going to sit here and drag this shit out. Yeah, we're going to rebound the time warp. Tick up. Okay. It's good to know. Oh, I didn't miss it getting in. It's fine. Um, gross bomb response. Oh, good. Now we got now we got the fair hero common area. All right. Rebound. Time warp. Cast it. Choose me. Next is a fate. Let's see. Well, uptick. Uh, down tick, Narset.
verdict to get rid of his creatures. Well, that's fine. Yep, I did that out of sequence. My bad. Yeah, okay. I did that way out of sequence. It'll be alright. No harm. Play this to fairy. Like, does he not see what's about to happen here? <laughs> oh, draw a card. Oh, really? Wow. End step. We got two triggers. Come on, dude, just quit. <laughs> he won't quit, man. Oh, Lord. Let's see if we can find it. Let's see if we find another one here. Uh, uptick. Saver, combat, Christ, swing. He's really making game one go out this go out this long. Yeah. There we go. Alright. We don't need these. We don't need these. We need these. Good God, man. Come on, dude. Seriously. You, like, you literally like... We win! Yes, we win degeneratively. Yes, we win. Why didn't he quit? Why did he just say, I am done, I can't beat this? I'm locked out. I can't play any of my non creature spells. Can't play any of my uh, violent outbursts or my um, rhinos. Boy, he went hard on the Force Negations, man. He went so hard. So hard on that. Uh, no, that's definitely not a keep. I would love you to chow something, man. Ugh. Christ. Yeah, well, okay. I can play fast. I can only go as fast as the computers people let me. Gonna go get. What is he playing? Blood Moon. This guy gonna play Blood Moon. <coughs> oh. 
what in the world? Was he got ice? He's gonna. Oh my god! Look at this fool. You know that doesn't help you. So we're at the same time, and I've ta my both monsters have taken at least twelve seconds. Okay, go go get your stupid thing. Really? Oh wow! We'll sack and go get. Uh... No. I think I'm eating his clock. Yeah, sure. What the fuck? Really? Oh, because I fucking... Wow. Is it three? I have to use a force negation. Force negation? Sure. Oh, well, miscal dispute. Wow. Well, no. Should have disputed that. And he and he's we're still above him in time, so he's we're basically saving four damage here, so I'm still a minute heady on the clock, buddy. I don't think you're winning this. Shouldn't cast it. Okay. You can't get the other footfalls. You're stupid. You can't cast the other one's a fairy on the field. Should have swung first. I'm going to wait for him to figure that out. <laughs> He's eating, he's eating his own clock. That's what he's doing. She just swung first, then made more rhinos. And had lethal on board next turn. He's trying to, he, he's, the game is telling him he can't do that. So. clock sure yeah the, the the violent outburst is fine 
you have a 5-4 Rhino, is you either A, swing at me for 5, or kill the fairy. Then what? Then what? Yeah, he's going to kill the fairy, which is pretty stupid, but whatever. I need to get another white source. You don't have to, though. Play a game of trials. Is he forcing action this? No, he doesn't. We'll go ahead and nerf the rhino. Pass turn. So now he can't hit me for four or to get in. He can sit there and eat all the clock he wants. He's approaching the six minute mark. Please stick. Wow! Stupid. No! Shit. Fuck. That was a misclick. That was a misclick. Well, now he can't. Is he going to swing at me? Yeah, he's going to swing at me. Love it. Love it. I go to three. Well, I guess we're going to have to uh, get the Gideon in the next turn. Get this out uh, of planes. Zero Gideon, get them on to protect ourselves. We'll play this Narset. Force me. Cool. You know, force negation this one? Nope, that sticks. Nice. It's always a fucking land. Okay. So now. <laughs> okay, so now he's got to kill the Gideon here. 
to make me lose. Because if it takes me to two, I can't lose with the Gideon Emblem out. He can't crash any more footfalls because I got Chalice on zero. Okay. Game ain't over, buddy. Sure as hell ain't over. Ugh. I'm gonna nerf that. Please don't be a land. Thank you. Uh, well, I can't... Yeah, I don't have any life to pay for that, so I'll just have to pass turn. Like, does he not know what's happening here? <laughs> does he not get it? <laughs> sure. Draw two cards. He's eating his own clock. Like, he, he doesn't know what the hell's going on here. Well, his deck's working. Figuratively, it's working, but it's so jank. So what's he going to play now? Destroy target artifact. No. Sorry, Dovin's Veto. Nope, sorry. You can't do that. Sorry. You got another one? I guess not. <laughs> Are we gonna really win the game at negative two life? Please draw an extra turn spell. Oh god, it's even better. Plus one Narset, and we got a time warp! We got one! Woohoo! Let's keep this rhino uh Yeah, so I have a time warp in my hand. We're gonna win the game on negative two life. First time on the channel, we're gonna win. The, we're gonna win a magic game, both games with negative life. Hilarious. That is hilarious. Play a breeding pool. Negative two Narset. Time warp. Choose me. Yeah. Rebound. Yeah. Uh, zero Gideon. Uh, we'll go ahead and lay line behind this rhino. Get out the field. Swing. Rebound. Target me. Take an extra turn. Besiege you. We'll take it up. The time warp. Yes. Uh, zero Gideon here. See, I can play fast. Go to combat. Swing. He goes to eight. Pass turn. Upkeep. Oh my god. Yes. Negative two. Yes! We win with negative two life. <laughs> <coughs> oh my god. What a game. What a degenerative way to win a game. Wow. Oh, shit. All right. Because of that, um, I'm going to take a break, get some drink, because that, that was way too long. 
So I'll be right back, guys. Stay with us.
All right. Let's go to game two. See if we can get any shorter games. I hope this ain't a long stream. Oh, excuse me. Yay, we'll go first. <coughs> Ugh. I don't like that hand. I like this one. Uh-oh. Vampire of the Dire Moon, huh? Pathway. Uh huh. Interesting. <clears throat> hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. dicey up here. The fuck? Oh, Convoke? Wow, what the... Okay.
Oh my god. How much is this? Oh, that's six. We got an eight. Let's go. This might be a quick one. Why am I buying the Nocturnus? <clears throat> See, little decks like this just really aggravate the piss out of me. We go to two. I really need a verdict. Oh, God damn it. Why? Oh, let's see. Hmm. All right, we're gonna go for the old Mary try here. Play it to fairy. I, if we draw the proving grounds, this might actually work. <clears throat> Down tick, uh, bounce the convoke, draw card. No, it didn't work. Can we lose? I hate little decks like this. Little decks like this just really piss me the fuck off, dude. Like, there's just nothing... Uh... Actually... Well, that's hard removal. This is not... He's not really Dovin's vetoing, though, is he? No, he's not. That might be too slow. <sighs> I hate little decks like this because it's just... Shit. That looks like a Pioneer deck, but whatever. Keep. Two prismatic, we have both our prismatic endings here, so. Come on, dude. Ain't got all day. Thoughtsies. But can you not afford Thoughtsies? No, you can afford it. Lord? Is 
since he's fastest internet. Alba fiber. Really need to find a verdict here. <clears throat> wow, what the fuck? Vanishing verse? Jesus, Lord. Sure. <laughs> that was... Didn't see that coming. You can't play nothing, so. I just gotta put a creature back down so we can have some. We have a draw step and an uptick with the fairy. Lieutenant. All right, yay, another Gideon. I think, let's see. Yeah, another vanishing verse. No, he's got that again. So 
we got a veto and a legion lieutenant. Boy, I need a verdict. Need a supreme verdict right about now. It'd be really great. <clears throat> Markov Baron? Oh, the Convoke. I was at a 3 3. Wow. Okay. Um, oh, that's even better. Um, yeah. Nope. Wrong zero. Shit. We'll see what happens. Are you gonna block? I guess not. I don't say. Go to fourteen. And there's the verdict. Uh, let's. What's up, man? We're in game two. Just trying to, uh, trying to win here. Okay, cool. So you may well both four fours. So he's gonna risk he's gonna lose eight damage to me and kill both my planeswalkers. Mm-hmm. Okay. Cool. That's nice. <clears throat> yeah, that's fine. Oh God. Jesus, thank you. Thank you, Jesus, man. Jesus Christ. Thank God. Um let's get a let's get a planes. Play it's fairy. No. 
lost creature. Leyline binding. Okay, so now we got... Yay! Alright. Now we got something. Now we got something going on. Now we've got it. Yes. Alright. Sure. It's fine. Fine with me. Well, I'm bonding your dude. Nice. Uptick. Look, we're gonna go... Reclamation. Yay! Okay. We're at five lands, we get to seven. I'll preordain. In response. It's gonna be alright. Oh, pfft. Bottom, well, top that. We need to land. Uh, sure. Where are you gain life? I'm going to lose the numbers. Cool. Neato. Okay. Cool. Uh, uptick, we got the blue light, saver, and step trigger, I want to float, Nexus fate. So now it's two turns we're taking. Uh play our set. Ah shit. Oh, it's double blue. Down tick. Uh, the Gideon. Gideon here. Nerf the Veto. Uh, uptick. On tap. <clears throat> yep. Then two Narsets. By the time warp, uh, I'm gonna uptick. Put in our sets. Doesn't know what's about to happen. Time warp. Yeah, rebound that shit. Yeah. <laughs> rebound. Target me. <laughs> oh, baby. Uh, let's. Oh, fuck. Mama, yes, please. Thank you. <clears throat> um.
Chalice. Chalice on three? How many pay, what, six? Chalice on two. Yeah, it's not gonna affect us. Ah, nice. And we're still going. Nice. Um, uptick? Uh, getting a creature? Look for what? Combat swing. Play this Elizabeth. Make three dudes. Pass turn. Trigger. Swing. Shoot. Boy, did I uptick to fairy, didn't I? I sure did. This verdict is a fucking game saver right here. He can't play any of his lords. He can't play a vanishing verse now. So our Gideon is protected from the chalice on two. Which is fine. Okay. Sure. Swing. I dare you. Actually, yeah, set a stop. When he goes to combat, I'm going to verdict. Because fuck him. Countered, unless you're unless you're doing the Kavok guy. Sure, resolves. Right, begin combat. Perfect. Love it. Place the fairy. Uptick. Next is a fate. Nice. Negative two. Uh, yeah. Zero. Swing. Trigger on the stack. Uh... And yeah, that's two more extra turns, y'all. Nice. Rebound. Target us. The, the, no, it went back in our deck. Oh my god, that's so stupid. <laughs> oh. Sweet mother of God. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. 
What? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is so stupid. We still got three games to go after this, too. We even get to that. Looks like a keeper to me. <clears throat> Brandon, I know you're going to watch this later. You should build this version instead of your red version. Because the Willard Reclamation is making it so stupid. I just gotta do a little more shaving, but I think I think it needs four to fairies and probably four narsets. You might be able to I don't know between the narsets. Narset goes in the deck somewhere. I don't know if it's four of or sure isolate a chapel. Yeah, great. Uh pretty full tap, go. Be degenerative. Well, you're gonna need to get the time warp, so that's a problem. Because in paper, they're about 13 bucks a piece. So that's gonna be a problem. Since he's fastest internet, we'll play that tap. Play this part of course. Tap, and then we will preordain. And what do we got? So we got domain three. Everything's gonna be alright. Uh huh. Sure. There we got a time warp. Nice. Play a three fairy. Bounce your thing. Replay your veto. <laughs> replay it. It's okay. You can go replay your veto. <clears throat> yeah, there you go. Good job. Good job. All right, uh, let's play this Hall of Fountain. We'll shock it in. We'll play the Gideon and we will prevent damage on Vito. Go to our second main phase, uptake the fairy pass. So even if he vanishing versus he doesn't get an attack step. So that's why we uptick. Because that way Vito can't start going off on shit. Right? And then we'll uptick, play a land, play Wolf Reclamation, and then Time Warp, take all the extra turn we can. It's not a creature. It's not a creature, you dumbass. What the fuck? Oh. Oh. So we just got all my getting to the trials. Who, what the fuck plays that sh Okay, fine. I've got other ways to win, sir. I thought it was just creatures. One, two, three, four. 
I guess I'll overtap. I gotta drop an Elspeth next turn. I have to drop an Elspeth because that, that's our only other win condition. We don't have any mainland or anything like that, so because he's gonna he's gonna try to lose he's trying to win by timing us out. So let's see gonna the end us again. Jesus. Yeah, I guess he fucking is, dude. Holy shit. Shit. Wow. So he's getting all our three fairies. Okay. We'll just drop this we'll have to drop this Elspeth and just fucking start making tokens. That's our next move. This guy'd be a complete salty butthole. Go ahead. There's our sixth land, which is what we need. Uh, draw a card. Elspeth. Make dudes. Alright, dude, you want to be a little butthole? How many of the ends you fucking got? Cause this is getting this is getting ridiculous. That's all you've done is played two of the ends. Like what the fuck? Jesus Christ! What do you got? Son of a bitch. Okay, that's fine. That's fine. These these tokens are gonna get there. Sure. Vanishing verse. Draw card. Come on, dude. Don't. Come on. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Cool. Play Windswept Heath, Crack It, and Temple Garden, I think. I'll get that. Uh, a blue, white. Play that. That's a sorcery. Oh shit. Alright, go get him go get him, soldiers. You gonna block one? Yeah, he's gonna block one. That's fine, I guess. I 
I forgot that was a sorcery. What else you got, man? Hmm. Let's say this turn against rebound. Okay. Another veto. Sure. He's convoking. Nice. Ah, that's what I want to see. Nice. Oh, they don't tap. That's great. Cool. Time warp. Thank you. This is so crazy. I'm going so fast. Wow, we fucking found it, so.
<laughs> damn it. This was taking all my fucking time, these goddamn triggers. <sighs> fucking Christ. <sighs> Just past turn, dude. Okay. Vindicate. <laughs> wow. Oh, we lost. Yeah, we lost. We lost because our clock does all the trigger stacking. Ah, oh, fucking Christ. I swear to God, dude, it's so aggravating. It's so aggravating. That's so aggravating, dude. We had it. We had that. So do we, do we count that as a moral victory? Do we count that as a... Uh, what do we count that as? Wait. We count that as a moral victory? Oh, God. Which button is it? Oh. Do we count that as a moral victory? Okay. All right. So let's go over the deck. Let, let's go over the deck. All right. Let's, let's, let's look at it here real quick. All right. So, okay, sure. Okay. Let's look at it, guys. All right. So, let, let's, let's take this deck into real life, uh, into, into paper magic settings, all right? You're going to have a 15 minute timer, all right? Most of the time at your, at your LGS or the big tournament, unless you're actually playing with a, with, with a fruitcake, they're going to sit there and be like, look, I don't, look, I'm going to, you're going to present, I'm going to present to you, I can take infinite turns and swing with infinite creatures, okay? I can do that. I'm going to do that. Take infinite turns, swing with these either tokens or this, or this Gideon and just, I'm going to win. Okay. Okay. Cool. Um, the reason we lost is because of our time, because the triggers from the Willis Reclamation, the, the fairy trigger, it's just, oh God. How can we fix this? Well, all right. Gross spirals feel like they didn't do shit. I think these need to be preordains. We'll start there for preordains. Uh, Saver, yeah, it's an extra turn. Um, Oath of Teferi, I think this needs to go. I think we need to put in another Urza Assembles of Titans. They do the, they do the same thing. They do the same thing. Urza Assembles of Titans do, they do the same thing. Here. Really? Well, that's not right. <sighs> that's not right. All right, chat room. We'll leave it up. What changes would you either add, cut, or or make from or add to this deck? Like, what would you change and uh, as it? Oh wow. Well. Let's try card quarter. If you're out there chat, what would you add change to this deck? I'm 
to spend a ticket on Assembles the Titans. Oh, God. Jesus. No, it's my OCD is what's really getting me. I don't have any tickets. Oh, hell. Okay. I kind of... I, what are we trying to make this deck better? Apparently the lands are not an issue. The lands are not an issue with this. I don't have any tickets. Wow, I don't. Elsbeth. Fucking the end, really? God, what a horrible. say maybe We could just run next to the fate. We really could. Like, we could just do that. Run format next. But time warp is so goddamn good, though. We got a side warp. Never cool. I'm never bringing any unless I'm playing mill. Probably get rid of the pack negation. All right, move this to the side. How many extra turn cards do I have in my collection? How many extra turn cards do I have? See, yeah, see, that's what I'm talking about is the four minutes of fairy. Like, Temporal Trespass, Temporal Time Walk. Yeah, like, we really could use that. <laughs> <clears throat> time vault yeah let's just let's just stick a time vault in there for the hell of it
myself for this, but I'll play one more game with this build. Officially, let's try it this way. We're officially 1 1 because of this stupid clock. We'll go for one more game, see if we can go 2 1 here on stream with this deck. I didn't really, I cut a lot early that doesn't really make a whole lot of sense, so. Our stream on extra turns deck. So this, so I got four time warps, two nexuses. So that's what I'm, I just cut an extra turn spell with time warp. Well, you could if you, if you add Jace, you could essentially. Uh, oh shit! Uh oh. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. Be right back. I get new batteries for my mouse. Okay. Our mouse was dying. Okay. There we go. All right. Last game with this. I don't know if the changes are going to be good, but PhD funk. Okay. We get scammed, we get scammed, we get Tron, we get Tron. We got nothing. He plays a Canopy Vista. Okay.
Wall of Omens. Okay, draw your card. Green, white. Interesting. <clears throat> okay. Is this like some kind of defender deck or something? Ah, shit. Well, I'll go get a hollow found because I fucked up. Play the Art of War. Play this to Fairy. I have no idea what the fuck he's doing, so. Um. Bounce that draw card. <clears throat> we will draw the card, thank you. Take my. Oh, shit, yeah. Gotcha. Check the screen. I forgot that. There we go. Thank you. Thank you for the reminder. Yeah. Thank you for the reminder. So. I think we just play a, a wilderness and pass. I don't know what he's doing. He's playing defenders. Uh, I bet this is tree folk. This has got to be tree. Well, I'm not having. I'm not swinging the creatures in, so. He can fuck right off. Planes. Uptick to fairy. Uh, what do I want to do? So I just want to get the fate seal on. Yeah, I'll just do that. I need to get my win condition going. So, fate seal. We'll start fate sealing him. Let's see what he's doing. Oh, Lord. Yep, go to the bottom. Five cards in hand. He's playing defenders. So I have no idea what this could be. Oh! Yeah. There we go. That's what it is. It's some bullshit like this. It just irritates the living fuck out of me. Okay. Fuck. Like, now I need my verdicts. Fucking Stupid shit like this, man. Dumbass. Dumbass crap like this, man. Dumbass shit like this. Son of a bitch. That's what, eight? It's 15 damage? If he's smart, he'll attack with, he'll try to alpha strike me next turn. There's now three verdicts in the main. We bumped it up to uh, three verdicts, I think. Wow. Okay, so there's one guy attack. He's going to add a green. He's not adding a green. Okay. All right. Yeah. Brainstorm, because we need to draw cards. Oh, lovely. Uh, Alright, here's what we're going to do. We're going to... Uh, we're going to 
put one of those back, one of those back. We're going to play Willow's Reclamation. We're going to uptick the ferry. Right. Okay. We're going to pass turn. And step. We're going to float a blue. Untap. Force of Vigor. I think I think it stops by itself. Hit OK. Time warp. Uptick. We will, we're going to have to brainstorm again. Because we need to find a verdict. Shit, prismatic ending? Shit. Okay, um, damn. Alright, not a bit, not a problem, not a problem. Um, we can put Teferi, uh, and this prismatic ending. Yeah, on the top. Um, let's see here. Play this guy. Uh, we will draw card. And discard a card. Play Flood of Stream. Um, hit OK. I am going to prismatic in the assault form. Uh, and full card. Yes. Get rid of that shit. Done. <clears throat> okay. Hit okay. In step, trigger. Time warp again. Pass turn. There's Matt again and cool. Um, we're going to uptick the ferry. Yay! Uh, Chalice is out. Preordains in, out. No, Chalice is in, preordains out. And probably this fucking Teferi. <laughs> Chalice on two seems really good against him. But what do you fucking know? There we go. Keep this shit. I've got everything I need to. Uh, play a Misty Pass. Sure, Wall of Blossoms. It's fine. He can play all the creatures he wants, but he's not getting that assault formation down. Absolutely not. I'm not losing to that dumb shit. 
Let's get us let's get us Spar's headquarters. Okay. Play breeding pool. No. It's okay. I'm not attacking creatures, fool. There's a verdict, thank God. That's why the Tibble Garden. Uh, no. All right, so we've got we got verdict into Chalice on two. We're doing it looking pretty good. It's looking pretty good. Looking pretty good. And we also got this backup to see you if you want to play Assault Formation. Oh, he's got blue in there somewhere. What's the blue for? The fuck is this? Okay, sure. Yeah. Fine. Whatever. The fuck? Whenever a creature defenders a battlefield control, draw a card. Oh, it's just another assault formation. So I take eight. Wow. Sure. I go to 11. What a... Fuck. It's so stupid. It really is. So fucking stupid. Get that shit out of here. Thank you. Move along. Thank you. Get out of here with that crap. <laughs> See... Assault formation decks. Dude, that would totally win at any local game store. Because nobody, nobody in their right mind would ever see an assault formation deck ever play at a competitive level in modern. Nobody. Not, no, uh, -uh no. People would just think like, oh, you play Wall of Omen, it's cool, you draw the card. Yeah, it's cool. Then bash you for 12. It's so fucking dumb. Sure, yeah, that's fine. Cool. Huh, sure. Okay, so Ottawara. I think we're just going to put Chalice on too and see what he says about that. Play auto war. Pass turn. All right, what you got? Remember, wall of omens, assault formations, overgrown battlements, wall of roots. That's what I've seen. You're gonna have to play your uh, your your fucking four mana creature again. If you want to take me down to two, I doubt you have one. We'll see. Uh-huh. Right. Does he have one? Oh, look at this guy. Okay. Okay. Pretty boy. <clears throat> Six. Green. It's convoking? Cord for four. Wow, dude. And let me and let me guess what he got. He gets that thing. Sure. Attack for five. Wow, yeah. Oh, he showed me. Oh shit. Only prismatic any for three. (sighs) 
Well, hmm. Cord of Calling. You can fuck right off on that shit. I need to draw a one swept teeth. I think we're just Plays this shit, dude. Not one person plays this style of deck. Honestly, nobody does. Son of a no one plays defenders. God, cord for Arcanus. Nobody plays that shit. God. <laughs> Keep. Nobody, nobody plays Arcanus in competitive level modern. Nobody does that shit. Nobody. Nobody does that shit. We're getting the, the proving ground first. Green, white, blue. No, no one does that shit. <laughs> Arcanus? Really? Oh my god, so fucking stupid. At this point, I don't care if he draw if he draws on that, or he plays wall opens again. I don't care. I don't care because then I can just chalice on two and hopefully lock him out. I want to draw a card. Draw Jace. Follow me. Arcanus. I want to spoil my defenders because I'm so cool. No, you're not. You're not cool at all. Oh, that's hilarious. Oh, that is so funny. Wow. That is hilarious. She just played your wall of this dude. It's going to be in a little turd bucket. Sure. What the fuck? What the hell, bro? Oh my god! What is this? What? That's not a card, man! That's not a deck! Quit playing some bullshit! Holy God! 
Oh my, oh my god, bro. Jesus Christ. <sighs> Shit. That's, that's not even funny, man. That... I can't target the wall of, the wall of denial. Stop playing stupid shit, dude. Oh my god. He would have had me at two if he just if he just swung the wall down on me instead of putting off the planeswalkers. High alert. Oh my god. Oh my god. What a All right, Verdict, let's go. I, I kind of need you right now. That's not going to do it. Play this, Jace. For the love of Christ, dude. Draw three. Thank Christ. Okay, uh... See, if he had just played, if he just swung at me, I would be dead. Right? Right? If he had just swung at me, I would be dead right now. Sure, yeah. Great, awesome. Play up, play, play all your things, dude. Do it. Cool. You would have won the game if you just swung eight at me. That's 24 damage that you have negated yourself because you're a greedy little fuck. That's true. That's what, uh, that's 17. He has another, he has another high alert. High alert. Are you serious? What the fuck, man? Wow. Oh my God. I'm blown away. Bullshit like this just pisses me off that they have exactly what they fucking need I don't get it I don't fucking get it it's, it's oh I don't have double white oh my god I don't have double white. I don't have double white. And I did not hit a fifth lane of time warp. Giddy's not gonna. Yeah, I lost. I lost because I, I do not have double white. I cannot cast Verdict. Casting a Gideon is not going to solve my issue. Because if I make the Emblem, he'll just swing the Gideon. He'll swing me for lethal. Take me to the negative life. Kill the Gideon. Because he plays high alert!
we can't phase out two creatures. And it doesn't matter because the, the walls are out. Yeah, good game, buddy. You play high alert. Congratulations. All right. So what did we learn? Okay, well, this needs to be in Dotha. Good night. No, wait, hold on. No, this needs to be a Savai Triome. Yes. There you go. Okay. Well, that was that was such an uneventful uh, ending to the night. Um, high alert. Whatever. Yeah, if, if, go take your take out your local game store and try to win with it. Well, that yeah, there there you go. It just shows that like we we lose to worse jank. So. But the deck did what it did. It would infinite, if you infinite turn someone out of the game, they pretty much don't have a, a, way, a winning strategy. They just you lock them out of the game. You can just win. Um, unfortunately, you better have other backups as, well as creatures. Um, I, we might stick in a man land or two, like uh, Hall of Storm Giants or even a Colonnade. Colonnade probably no, maybe Hall would be better. It's a seven seven. Yeah, so we'll probably put in a Hall of Storm Giants. Um, Probably, fuck it, I know. Uh, well. I don't know. We need, so, um, so this, this, the, this, the Proving Grounds comes out for the Savoy Triome because we need to have the Mountain Swamp to get our domain up to five, but we also need a white source to, uh, as you saw there, we need to be able to cast Verdict. Verdict would have gotten this baby another turn, but we didn't have double white. So we need the, the Savoy Triumph to get to the double white. The That fits our domain perfectly. Um, you don't want to add like, you need to be able to get your domain because of the Prismatic ending, so, or the Leyline Binding, I'm sorry. But the deck game was supposed to do. I thought we, I think we trimmed some of the fat. Uh, the periodanes might just go anyways. As for like maybe counter spells, uh, or maybe like, fuck, I don't know, maybe an elixir mortality to reshuffle. But I think we're probably gonna put maybe uh, probably cut a flooded strand. Probably put in a hall of storm giants, something like that, to. Uh, have a win condition that's not a Gideon, as you saw. Somebody plays the end and got rid of our Gideons and our Teferis. So the deck is pretty good. I like it. This is the actually first official loss with this deck since I built it in the past two days. I played with it yesterday um, before our internet went out. Went 4 0 and just played four games, one ball, four games. So this is our loss. So it's really, we went 2 we went 2 1. We won that last game, even though a time ran out. I don't really count that because we had a win set up. So, but I'm gonna load this all on the YouTube channel tonight. You can check us out at Kentucky Eclipse Gaming over on YouTube. You can watch this if you want later on. But uh, that's gonna do it for me here tonight because it is two hours thirty five minutes. And uh, yeah, I'll be back tomorrow with another deck. Probably not this. Probably something better. And we'll we'll check our we'll check our finances see if we want to go to the league. But that's gonna do it for me here tonight. If you if you're watching me later, you like what you see here. We play all sorts of decks. Jank, uh, meta, budget, money, uh, finances, allowing. We don't have rings. Like, we don't have the one range. We're not Bowmasters yet. So we can't play four color control. We can't play scan with full power. We can't play Grixis Death Shadow. Because we don't have Bowmasters. We don't have rings. But we have compensation. So, if you like what you see here, follow me or subscribe to me on, on Twitch. We greatly appreciate it. But uh, I'll be back here tomorrow with some more modern for you. Until then, this is Spell for Kentucky Eclipse Gaming. Telling everyone to have a good night. See you later.